to the second part of my question right now that you like get used to the 10 day silent retreats how has your view about yourself changed so what has the inner discoveries been and how does that balance out with the outer success yeah so the way my view of myself has changed is letting go of the view of myself so ultimately it's this attachment to ideas and identification with thoughts and what we've accomplished and all of these things that we hear about we know we shouldn't be i'm not just chris who's a, a ux designer with a career sure. and owns this and that on all of these things that we attach our identity to and and ultimately thoughts every thought that comes along that we engage in that we give our yeah. attention to becomes an identification with a thought and then that takes us down into rabbit holes and we spend at least half of our day lost in thought yeah. which is if you think about it time not really spent alive being here engaging with what's real so yeah we spend so much effort and longevity and health and living a good long life but we're <laughs> spending at least half of that time not really being present the ultimately what calms us down and this is the biggest revelation and everyone encounters this when they first go down their mindfulness path is that the way we make peace with everything with our thoughts with our environment with people is to come out of resistance to them and to see them as they are the way you calm the mind is not by wanting to calm the mind but by accepting <laughs> that it's yeah. not calm which is paradoxical. This is how it works. The surrender, the non-resistance to what is ultimately yeah. brings you into peace and balance and harmony with things. And you can apply that then to everything. So my, all my results improved. I realized I had just been putting brick on brick my entire life and that there's a much easier, lighter, more organic way mm. to let life unfold, to be responding and engaging with it as opposed to always controlling, steering and wanting it your way which is yeah. ultimately a really hard way to go. So yeah, yeah that, it changed everything. My results in sports improved, my clarity and decision-making, my creativity, no longer feeling blocked or having the tools to know what to do when you feel creative block, my ability to listen to other people with the quality of attention that you bring into your projects and the detail and across the board, it's a dramatic improvement.